Awas, wu, wu, wu. Hariap, hariap. Open the gate. Yes, yes. I'll open the gate. Open the gate. Quickly. Yeah, yeah, come on, come on, come on. I was here in the night shift. Yes, I came here at 11 o'clock. Yes, 11 in the night. The morning shift guy left and I took his place. And the moment I wore my uniform and took charge, suddenly some people came. All of them were holding tools in their hands. They simply opened the door and then they just barged in. happened around midnight and after that kalpana trividhi but how can we declare it as a murder i don't see any sign of struggle hmm found any evidence no inspector sir there are no fingerprints here and i don't see any foul play as well hmm Keep looking you will find something. Okay sir. Doctor, what does your report say? Uh inspector sir, as far as I think, she died between 1:30 and 2 in the night. But what was she doing here late night? I will tell you inspector sir. Kalpana Trivedi was a very strange woman. She often stayed in the museum till late night and used to write something. Probably she was doing some research about something. Who are you? Oh, Inspector Sir. My name is Didi Desai and I am the administrator of this museum. So what do you know about her? Any family member or relatives? Anyone? Inspector Sir, Kalpana Trivedi wasn't married. Everything that was in her life was in this museum. She loved everything about this museum. She considered this museum as her world inspector sir. That's it. Thanks Mr. Desai. If we need any more information about her, then you will have to come to the police station. Yeah, sure. Whenever you call me, I will be present sir. Thanks for your cooperation. Thank you. Constable? Yes sir. If you have all the photographs then send the body to post mortem. Okay sir.
friends, you all know very well that we have gathered here for the peace of Miss Kalpana Trivedi's soul. Miss Kalpana Trivedi was a loyal and a good person. Miss Kalpana Trivedi had dedicated her entire life to this museum. Rather it not be wrong to say that this museum was her life, this was her world. Today, Miss Kalpana Trivedi is not with us. But her memories will always be fresh in our hearts. Let us all together pledge that we will complete her unfinished works. And let's pray to the Almighty God that He shall give peace to Miss Kalpana Trivedi's soul and grant her a place in heaven. Savita, yes, mom. So you have finally decided to go, mom. You clearly know this is a big opportunity for me. Getting a job as curator in Lal Bahadur Shastri Museum is not a small thing. I very well know that, but why don't you understand that what was the name of that first curator of the museum? He is Kalpana Trivedi. Haven't you read about her that how she died in that museum? Yes, but didn't you read the complete news, mom? That it was just an accident. But still, Kalpana, I'm very scared. Oh, come on, Mom. This is not a new debate. We have already debated a lot on this topic, and didn't we decide that we will no longer debate on this topic, right? Fine. But are you taking Rahul with you too? Of course. There's nothing to be scared of, Mom. I've already filed the admission papers, and if I leave him here, then he'll become big trouble for you. And by the way, this is the time for you to rest, not work. Great. So you think this works for me? Your dear husband, he has gone to America for training, and now you are taking Rahul with you. So I'll be all alone in this house. Is there a way that I can come with you too? <laughs> I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> That's why I have already packed all your things. <laughs> Just see, Rahul. Rahul dear, come quickly, son. Yes, mama. Didn't I tell you that Granny will come with us? She cannot live without you. She's coming with us. Granny is coming Ooh. with us. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Shiram, it's me speaking. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yes, sir. Look, our plan has been flopped. Y yes, sir. I don't know how the vehicle suddenly caught fire and all our companions were killed. Kashiram, I have one more job for you. Please tell me, sir. In this museum, there is a sword engraved with diamonds. You will have to steal that sword and bring it to me tonight. You will be paid handsomely for it. Sir, you have trusted Kashiram. Your trust will not go in vain. As soon as my shift gets over, the sword will be in your hand. And listen, if anything goes wrong this time, then this time I am gonna kill you. Understood? No, sir. Please have full faith on me, sir. The job will be done, sir. Trust me, sir. Okay.
minuto. Kashiram, how are you feeling now? It's paining a lot. Okay, okay, lot, don't sir. worry. In one or two days, we can uh, remove the stitches. Then you can go home. All right, uh, sister. Give him a painkiller. Kashiram. Yes, sir. Hello, sir. Hello. How did all this happen? It is very scary, sir. Like every other day, even tonight. I was doing my duty. I have a habit, sir. Before locking any room, I check all the items in that room. And today, when I went towards the room of weapons, then, sir, you know what I saw? In the air, the weapons were flying in the air, as if, as if someone was, sir, sir, I. I started running. Then, then, sir, I felt as if someone had stabbed a dagger in my back. Sir, it's not a normal room, sir. Sir, sir, that room is haunted by death, sir. Sir, whoever enters that room will never ever come out, sir. Will never come out. How can that be possible? That there's no one in the room and the weapons start flying in the air. No, Kashiram. I think you were not in your senses. Look, look, Kashiram. <laughs> Kashiram. No. Kashiram, what happened? No, 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 no. no. Kashiram. What happened? No. 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 Kashiram. Kashiram. No. No. Kashiram. No. Kashiram. No. What happened, Kashiram? No. no. Kashiram. No. Doctor. No. Doctor. No. 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 Doctor. Doctor, what happened to him? Oh no, he's dead. He's already dead, sir. My God, but how, doctor? Yes, dear sir. I think due to extreme fear, he had a severe heart attack. Just look here. You can see fear in his eyes. Today, you will have to finish the whole glass of milk. Understood? Take it. Yes, mom. What's the matter? I told you, don't go there. What? One more death. Where? In that museum. And this time, the security guard has been killed. What? Yes. Here, look at this. People say it's a museum of ghosts. And spirits reside there, Savita. Mom, your daughter is not afraid of ghosts. I am afraid of humans. Okay, Rahul. Today is your first day at school. Be a good boy, okay? By but the listen. way, even it's your mom's first day at work. And you know what? 
Your school is there now. It's near to your mom's museum. Someday I'll take you there. Mommy has kept his uh, bottle and tiffin in the bag, right? Yes, I've okay, kept everything. On, but go. but please go. listen to me. Late. Later on, mom. Let's go. Come on, come on, quickly. Savita. Oh God, protect her. Welcome, Mrs. Suri. Welcome. Thank you. Hello. This is Ramni class. Hello. This is Madan Gopal. Hello. And this is Chaman Lal. Hello. Hi. Driver. Yes. Please take this. You are welcome here. Please come in. Thank you. Please come in, Mrs. Suri. Let me show you the museum. Ah, uh, Mr. Ramni Lal. Yes, sir. You all wait for me in the conference room. I will meet you there. Okay, sir. Please come in. Mrs. Suri, mm. this is the room of old idols. Come, let me show you. Please, Mrs. Suri, this is the room I was talking about. You can see all the idols here. You can see all kind of idols. Mm -hmm. Here, you can see all kinds of old and priceless idols. What do you think? Huh? I have read a lot about these idols in your museum's catalog, and for the rest, I'll need your help. <laughs> Please, hmm. I will show it to you. This, this is our armory section. I mean, where we keep all the weapons. But why is it locked, Mrs. Suri? Because, due to some really strange incident, one of our museum security guard, Kashiram, died in this room. and according to his statement which he gave he mentioned that this room should be never opened it should always remain closed but what exactly did kashiram say mrs suri it's better if you don't ask about it because it will be difficult for you to believe it's true kashiram was injured by a dagger but he died due to due to a heart failure and due to fear and terror what are you saying mrs savita suri Today is your first day at work. We have a lot of time to discuss these matters. Come, let me show you your office. Okay. Come in, Mrs. Suri. Thank you. This is your office. Very nice. You get acquainted with your office. I will see you later. I want to get acquainted not only with this office but with the entire museum. Let me just check out these files. Later I'll go on round. Then I'll meet you. Okay, Mrs. Suri. Thank I'll leave. Sorry Mrs Suri I just wanted to tell you that my room is the third from here if you need anything What happened Mrs Suri You are looking a bit upset that someone left this note in my cabin
I think it's just an innocent prank, Mrs. Suri. You don't worry. I'll look into it. Be comfortable. Thank you. Bye bye. -bye. Tell me, how was your day at the school? I had so much fun, Granny. Made so many friends. Played a lot of games. Great. The first day itself, you made friends. Now, give this to me. Okay, Savita. How was your day? Now, what to tell you, Mom? That museum is a wonderful museum, and the people over there are strange. There's a guy named Mr. Desai. Do you know what he says? What did he say? <laughs> he says that you know the armory room in the museum, right? So in there, the weapons themselves start flying on their own. Imagine, Savita, you are saying as if this is just a very minor thing. It's not an ordinary thing. It's a funny thing as well. No, Savita, this is not at all funny. There's definitely some mystery to it. Mystery? Mystery. Yeah. Hmm. If there's actually any mystery there, then tonight I should go and check. What exactly happens there? Is it just a story or is there any truth in it? Right? Mummy, I will also come with you. No. Huh? No one will go there. And I don't want to hear anything on this topic. Granny, you are such a coward. So what? Hey. I am a coward. <laughs> but you won't go there. And listen, Savita. Hmm. Even you are not supposed to. Come mom. on, come on, go to your room. Oh, uh, mom, stop being childish now. Listen, mom. Hmm. I will go there. Definitely. We'll go and check the museum. What exactly happens there? Watchman, that armory room is there, na? I want the keys for it. But madam, we are not allowed to go in that room. I am not even allowed to be anywhere near the room. When did I ask you to come with me? You just give me the keys. I'll open the door. Ma'am, please listen to me. Even you should not go there, ma'am. What is your name? Radheshyam. So, Mr. Radheshyam, you just do your duty. Give me the keys. Fast. Here is the key, ma'am. Thank you.
You scared me to death. Even I got scared, Mama. So you were following me till here? Didn't Granny tell you not to come here? But didn't Granny tell you the same, Mama? Shut up, naughty. Don't be over smart now. Go, go quickly. Wait in the car. Go now. No, Mama. I want to see the museum. So you won't listen to me. Come, be quiet, okay? such amazing weapons what happened mummy nothing What are these? Rahul, in the ancient times during the war, na, soldiers used to wear this for protection. These are called armors. Wow! Mummy, this is such a big museum. Yes, dear, it's a very famous museum. leave from here but i have a condition who, who is that who is speaking who is there you still haven't answered my question w what what is your condition from here on this room will always remain closed and it will never be opened but why who are you why do you want this because everything which is kept here is the heritage of this country it's all linked to our ancient history it's all linked to the culture of this country so that's why i want this room to be locked forever tell me do you agree or not just see see whatever you want i will also do that but who are you why are you not coming in front
सविता सूरी आई एम कल्पना त्रिवेदी कल्पना त्रिवेदी नो दिस कैन नॉट हैपन कल्पना त्रिवेदी शी वाज शी वाज किल्ड इन एन एक्सीडेंट नो आई डिडंट डाई इन एनी एक्सीडेंट वेदर आई वाज मर्डर्ड my murderer is living a peaceful life and i i am wandering as a soul i want justice i just want to avenge my death i can clearly see that towards this profession you have the same respect the same amount of love which i had when i was alive this museum is no less than a temple for me but in this city there are some greedy people who want to earn a lot of money lot of money and when the money becomes god for human beings then even he can leave god for money and become a monster you're absolutely right i have read a lot about you heard a lot about you and i also know that behind the success of this museum you had played an important role let me tell you something about myself i was raised by my grandfather durga prasad trivedi my mom dad passed away when i was just around 6 7 years old my grandfather was very fond of collecting old things and antiques he often took me to such amazing places where you couldn't even imagine that in those places there could be such old and priceless heritages of our country one day i went with him to such a place yay yay grandpa 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 listen kalpana yes grandpa oh kalpana you are here hmm. kalpana Didn't I tell you to stay close to me? Look, Kalpana, always stay close to your grandpa because this forest is very big. There are very wild animals: snake, bear, tiger. Kalpana, you don't be scared. Mm-hmm. Just always hold my hand, okay? How will you hold my hand? Like this. Yes, very good. Careful, Kalpana. Along with the animals, we have the vegetation, and you are seeing the branches. Yes. It is used to make good yes. medicine. People get cured with this. Did you understand? Huh? Be ah. careful. There are many deadly thorns. Ah. Huh? Huh? Ah. Oh. Ah. Be careful. Slowly. Ah. Ah. Please ah. come. Please come. Ah. Hold my hand. Ah. Uh-huh. Yes. Very good. Listen, my child. Whatever I have told you, when you go home, put it on your notebook. Okay? Yes, Grandpa. Grandpa, <laughs> what is that? Uh-huh. Temple in the forest. Come, Kalpana. Let's go, Grandpa. Let's go. Come. Kalpana this is a Natraj statue looks like 7 to 800 years old because Kalpana do you see the black stone used in the statue with that i think it must be built in the 12th century i will definitely write to the department of archaeology because anybody can steal this precious statue okay i will write to the archaeological department
whenever i went with my grandfather i remember everything and especially the statue of nataraja i saw in that forest and whatever my grandfather said about the statue that's exactly what happened Looks like seven to eight hundred years old. Because Kalpana, do you see the black stone used in the statue? With that, I think it must be built in the twelfth century. Excuse me. Yes, ma'am. That Nataraja statue. May I know its price? Uh, Which statue, ma'am? That, that one. Uh, sorry, ma'am. That statue is already sold. Already sold? But we have many more statues. If you want, I can show them. No, thanks. Grandpa, Grandpa, Grandpa. Ah, uh, Kalpana, what's the matter? You come with me. But where? Grandpa, I want to show you something which will surely shock you. But Kalpana, what is that thing, and where is it? Now, when you come with me, only then I can show you. Come, get All up. All right, fine. Get up. Let's go. Come. Oh yes. Come, Grandpa. Kalpana, why have you brought me here? Grandpa, do you remember when I was a child, you took me to Forest of Reva, and there was an old temple, and there was a statue of Nataraja of the 12th century? Yeah, yeah, Kalpana, I remember it. Grandpa, that statue. Statue? Huh? What? Where is that statue? It was here. Hello, Durga Prasad sir. Good up. Hello, hello. What happened? What do you need? Oh, this. Just now there was a statue of Nataraja. Right. This is Nataraja statue. See. No, no, not this statue. The black stone one. Black stone statue. Yes, a while back we talked about it, right? No, no, ma'am. We don't have any such statue here. But sir, uh, I'm talking about the same statue which you said was sold out. I said so, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> you are under a misconception, ma'am. We never had any such statue in here. You must have seen it somewhere else. No, no, it was exactly <laughs> here. Okay. Durga Prasad sir, you have come here for the first time. Please look around what you want. Till then, I'll make arrangements for tea okay, and snacks. Okay. Right? Okay. <laughs> but Kalpana, it was your grandpa. Huh? I saw it right here. Eh? <laughs> After that incident, in Lal Bahadur Shastri Museum, I took over the role of curator. Savita in this country this museum is a unique museum in itself My grandfather also gave his entire precious and unique collection to this museum before he died One day I was just doing the rounds and then I saw the owner of this art gallery Mr Hira Lal talking to one of the security guards of this museum Kashi Ram Hiralal sir, this statue may look very small, but it is worth crores of rupees in the market. Crores. Well, I only do business in crores, Kashi Ram. <laughs> you too will be rewarded handsomely for it. Don't worry. Uh, uh, 
प्लीज कम हिरा सर आई शो यू मोस्ट एशियस ये दिस वे दिस वे Mr. Desai, are you busy? <laughs> no, no, Kalpana, madam. Tell me. See, whatever items we have in this museum, I want all the documents of those items, with complete details. Uh, yes, yes. Why not? Uh, I will personally make that list for you. But what's the matter, Kalpana, madam? Is there any problem in the museum? No, no. As of now, there isn't any. Just wanted to update myself on the new artifacts. <laughs> okay, I will send you that list. Thank you. Bye. Hey, Desai. Why the long face? Hiralal sir, things are not right. The new curator, Miss Kalpana Trivedi. Yes. You know, today she saw you talking with Hira Lal. Huh? Hey, so what's the problem in that, my friend? Hira Lal, sir, you don't know her yet. She is a very crazy woman. Today she has asked for a list of all the items. <laughs> so what if she is asked? Just keep ignoring. This time it won't work, Hira Lal, sir. Kalpana Trivedi is a very stubborn woman. and she won't keep calm until she gets everything sir i don't know why she considers the property of a museum as a personal property okay let me meet her once Good afternoon. You? Why are you here? Come on, Kalpana, ma'am. People have welcomed their enemies at home, and I'm just here to talk about some things. Look, I don't want to talk to you, Hira Lal. And yes, I know that the people even welcome their enemies at home. But I will never let traitors like you ever enter my house, Hira Lal. <laughs> Well, you are the daughter of Durga Prasad Trivedi. Obviously, you have inherited all his qualities. Hira Lal, sir, I don't have any intentions to argue with you about the merits and demerits of my grandfather. Hurry up, tell me why you came here. Look, Kalpana, ma'am, the position you are in at the moment. In that position, you should be living in a luxurious bungalow. You must have a few servants to serve. Some. Beautiful, luxurious cars, you see, and at least you must have ten, twelve crores of bank balance. Oh, you are trying to bribe my dignity and my integrity. Come on, Kalpana, ma'am. Just forget about those things. Those are just some words. Life is very small, and you should live it to fullest. So yes, Kalpana, ma'am. Actually I came here to tell you that uh, didn't you ask me about uh, a statue of Nataraja in the emporium the one made with black stone that statue I'm willing to give you in exchange for our friendship <laughs> what yes ma'am actually I was about to bring the statue with me then I thought I should ask you once If you are 
willing to be friends with me then believe me the reward of our friendship will start from lakhs and end up in crores of rupees What are you thinking? To keep that statue, I have made a temple too made with precious stones which dates back to 6th century. Hira Lal sir, your offer has forced me to give it a second thought. <laughs> come, please come. <laughs> come on. Hira Lal sir. Yes. Please sit. Thank you. Yeah. So, please tell me Kalpana ma'am. Well, <laughs> you have placed such an offer before me which is impossible for me to reject. <laughs> Because that Natraja statue, I still can't get it out of my head. <laughs> That's it then. Let's shake hands. Today itself that statue I'll get it at your home. No, no, not at my home, Hira Lal sir. Please send it to the museum in my office. Though it will be in the museum, but it will be my personal property. <laughs> I have no issues with it. Send it to your office. If you don't mind, can I ask you something? You are way smarter than you look. If that statue would have been in your house. Then anyone would have suspected. But if that statue is in the office, then no one will suspect you. <laughs> I must tell you, you are smarter than I thought, Hira Lal sir. How quickly you understood my point. But that's where I made a mistake. Hmm. What mistake? I wanted to catch Hira Lal red-handed. Hmm. So I called the Sai from my home and informed him to call the police. before i reached the museum but i did not know that the sai was also involved with hirala Hello Hiralal sir it's me Desai speaking i need to talk to you very urgently leave all that now your miss kalpana has joined hands with me <laughs> that is what i want to tell you sir she has not joined hands with you instead she has laid a trap for you what do you mean just a while kalpana trivedi called me and said that i should call the police at the museum oh so that's a plan Thank you Desai for informing me. Now the police will definitely come to the museum. But uh, but what are you saying sir? Hey you don't worry Desai. Now you don't have to call the police. I will do it myself. You just do as I say Mr Desai. Hello 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 Look madam as per your request i have called the police here but can you tell me what is the matter this i any time soon the owner of this art gallery hiralal will be here as soon as he enters the museum i want the police to cover the entire museum and then wait for my signal okay madam everyone please surround the museum and wait for my signal hurry up You can signal me on the intercom. Okay.
गुड इवनिंग मैम गुड इवनिंग कीप दिस डाउन यू गाइज लीव एंड वेट फॉर मी इन द कार प्लीज सेट थैंक्स सो मैम देसाई सर है सेंड कॉफी फॉर यू कीप इट Any message for this, sir? Yes. Inform him the work I told him to do. Please do it now. Okay. Please have the coffee. Ha, <laughs> ma'am. You also take. What a fantastic coffee! Yes, we have made all arrangements for our night staff. Okay. Kalpana ma'am are you going to open your present Of course I will Hira Lal sir What's the hurry Now the whole world will see it This I sir Well we are almost done with the coffee What I informed you to do Did you do it or not? <laughs> Kalpana ma'am Desai sir has already done what you were supposed to do. What do you mean? I mean this coffee will be the last coffee of your life. What? Yes. In this coffee I have added a special medicine due to which your body will gradually go to sleep and after that <laughs> that means the size also involved with you oh yes the size sir too <laughs> But then the police all of them are my men
Who are you? What are you doing here? I asked you, who are you? How did you enter here? spoken such a dangerous truth kalpana ji this is so heartbreaking you were you were brutally murdered and the world doesn't know anything about it everyone thought that it was just an accident not just them even i thought the same till date because at the place where you were murdered police never found any fingerprints over there but now i understand it because that murder was done by wearing gloves right yes they very cleverly murdered me hira lal desai these two goons and kashiram <laughs> kashiram already got the punishment for his actions i killed him right here he came to steal a very precious diamond engraved sword i could stop them while i was alive but now no one can steal or touch anything from this room savita i will definitely take revenge from my murderer especially from hiralal and desai these two dangerous bastards are selling the heritage of our country if these people are not punished then it would be a disgrace to law and justice you are absolutely right kalpana ma the torture you had to suffer the injustice you had to go through those bastards should be punished for all of it only then the justice will be served may i come in yes miss savita please come in Please take it. What is in this envelope? My resignation. Resignation? But what happened, Miss Savita? Mr. Desai, when I came to this museum, I thought that I would be given complete freedom to work over here. Yes, I have given you full freedom. No, you have kept the armory room locked and restricted the public to go inside. Look me Savita you very well know the reason behind it there's no reason Mr Desai this is just an unnecessary fear a misconception in your mind and nothing else what what are you saying all i'm saying is if the armory room is not opened then i'm leaving this position Miss Savita please listen to me you know very well that if you open that room then god knows how many lives will be lost And don't you know Kashiram was also killed in that room? Whatever happened to Kashiram, I don't know. But as far as I am concerned, you should come with me there, and then all your misconceptions will be sorted. Do you hold any personal grudge against me? Huh? What did I do to you, Mr. Desai? I am not your enemy. In fact, I am your friend. Please come with me. All the doubts in your mind will go away. Please come with me. But come. Okay fine let's go Let's go Let's go Come Here is the key Open the door
Let's go. No. I won't go in. And I would request you that please, please you also don't go in. <laughs> Miss Savita, listen to me. Please. Miss Savita. Miss Savita. सविता मिस सविता ऋषि मिस सविता मिस सविता मिस सविता यस व्हाट हैपेंड आर यू स्केर्ड नो नो आई एम नॉट स्केर्ड सी ना आई टुक अ राउंड ऑफ होल रूम Did anything happen? Anything happened to me? No, no. You were unnecessarily getting scared. Come, come with me. Don't be afraid. Come, come with me. Come. Let's go. Oh God. Please come. Desai, what happened? There's nothing. You were frightened of nothing. Miss Savita, hmm? that that sword which is kept there, hmm? which is engraved with diamonds. Hmm. Please, please, can you pick it up? Hmm? Why? What would happen if I pick it up? You please pick up that sword. Okay. Sword? Yes, I did. What happened? Nothing. Yes, nothing happened. You were telling the truth. <laughs> We were getting scared of nothing. Hmm. This was just a misconception, Miss Savita. Please, please take back your resignation. Hmm? And uh, regarding opening this room for a general public, then a committee meeting will be called in which it will be decided. And after that, this room will be open to the general public. I promise you. If that's the case, then I'll take back my resignation. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Savita. <laughs> Thank you very much. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. What nonsense are you talking, Desai sir? Have you totally lost your mind? No, I haven't lost my mind. Rather, the misconception and illusion in which that is lost. Now I can see very clearly that there was nothing wrong with that room. Hira Lal sir, tonight for us, it will be like the story of Ali Baba and the Forty Thieves. 
you just come with me in that room everything in this room will be our sir and yes remember this is once in a lifetime chance or else you will have to regret it because after one week that room will be open to the general public hey this i i still don't believe your words what has happened to you hiralal sir i myself i went there with miss avita she touched everything and picked up thing and nothing happened to her sir trust me there's nothing wrong with that room and that what happened with kashiram that what was that oh come on hiralal sir that was an unfortunate accident please remove this from you you listen to me you are not going in that room alone i am going to come with you is it if that's the case then okay tonight i'll come with you <laughs> let's go let's go mm. come sir come come mr desai i hope everything is planned everything is well planned there's nothing to worry watchman open the door okay sir come let's go please come in after you okay please come open the lock okay please come after you mr desai hiralal sir why don't you ever trust me look look desai sir if there is anyone who i trust that's only myself now go in Okay Please come. Huh? Why are you shocked, sir? I just checked the whole room. Please come with me. Please. <laughs> come on. Come. On. Come. Here, all sir. Yes. There. There is your sword. Hiralal sir, pick it up. This, what is all this? I have no idea, sir. Who is it? Where did all this disappear? Who is doing all of this? Leave all these desai run just run 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 run
What is happening, sir? I cannot move. What is happening? You? Yes, it's me. What happened? Why are you scared of me? With what intention did you both come here? That you will so easily loot the wealth and heritage of our country? No, 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 no. no. For the greed of money, you both are selling the symbol of our ancient history? Uh, no, 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 no. What do you think? This sword, this dagger, this spear, this armor, these precious statues, which tell the stories of our culture, <laughs> which once sold to other countries cannot be retrieved back? You were going to trade them? And you thought no one will stop you from doing so? Forgive me. Please forgive me. He, he Lala had bribed me in doing all of this. Please, please, please forgive me. Shut up! This Hira Lal had tried to bribe me as well. Instead, I gave my life, but did not sell integrity. And you? You were the protector of this ancient pride. And you are selling it for greed of money? No. You cannot be forgiven. <laughs> Desai, these are the things that our future generations will look back upon and learn about our past. <laughs> they will take inspiration from it. And you? You were going to sell these and kill our history forever? <laughs> no. Hira Lal, you desperately wanted this diamond and great board. Now just wait and watch how I will kill you with the same sword. <laughs> no, 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 Kalpan, no, please forgive me. No, Hiralal. You don't deserve forgiveness. <laughs> no, 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 Please have mercy on me. Please have mercy on me. Please have mercy on me. Please, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Desai, I won't forgive you. You too will be punished to death for your crimes. You are a traitor. <laughs>